beautiful sunset from our Harrisburg Sky Cam on this Halloween Eve. It is very nice out there. 51, a little cool. West Northwest breeze that's starting to settle down too. As the winds drop, temperatures going to drop too. We'll probably quickly get back down into the 40s as we go through the evening hours with those diminishing winds. Then overnight tonight, clouds move back in. That's what we uh, when we talk about for our forecast. We we watch for when those clouds come in. When they come in late tonight, temperatures drop to their maximum uh, depth, and we're going to be in the low to mid 30s tonight. So it's going to be hard to warm it up tomorrow with cloudy skies. And then we think some light rain western counties maybe during the later morning hours, but most of us I think we'll see it around midday. And I'd favor it northwest of Harrisburg, but it's going to keep it almost chilly. 40s to near 50 degrees for tomorrow afternoon. Mid 50s today, our top number 46 was the low, although I think it'll go in the calendar book a little below that 46 degrees. So we'll still have to figure out the numbers for this month, but I'll tell you what, it has a, been a warm one so far. 49 right now in Lancaster and Lebanon, and 48 in Reading and Coatesville. Everybody else seeing the 50s except for uh, up in uh, Sealands Grove. There's the radar. We're clear. So there's no problem out there this evening for the trick or treaters. Should be nice. A little bit of cloudiness off to our north. I'm not worried about that. That's heading to our north. You see all this moisture kind of streaming in this stream. Well, that's going to come toward us. It's a, in advance of a storm. What's happening is warm air, a stream of warm air is going to come to the north. But high pressure is building over us. That's diminishing the winds. That's going to give us clear skies through the evening hours. But as it pushes away and we lose that, that stream of moisture is going to start coming in. First is some clouds late tonight. And then we think as the storm lifts up toward the lakes, it forces that warm air up and over this cooler air. Not a washout, but I, I do think it's kind of damp, maybe drizzly and some rain at times. That rain continues to lift to the north. That warm front does too. We may start a little cloudy and maybe a little foggy on Thursday. I think the clouds break, but we're going to get into this warmer air as we head into Thursday starting uh, the new month. 30s overnight tonight, then only in the 40s tomorrow. But then look at that. We could be up near 70 degrees as we get into Thursday. And I think even near Friday, too. Cold front gets here Friday, but it's not until late in the day. Maybe a few showers around uh, for high school football, but it doesn't look like a big deal. Then a seasonable day. I thought there may be some rain coming in on Saturday. Looks like it may hold off until late Saturday or Saturday evening. And we get a little bit of rain or drizzle around on Sunday. But hey, we can sleep in that morning for an extra hour mile next week too. I think the early